This piece is about reunion in heaven, and it's my dad, and it's me. I lost him to uh, lung cancer two years ago. Lacey represents me, and Neil represents my dad. His name is Joe. Mia and Joe, Mia and dad, dancing together again. In order to do this dance, you have to have the emotion right, and I don't want to let Mia down because this is her personal story. I feel I have to get this dance right, or else I think Mia would feel that she would have wasted this idea. Whatever happens with this piece is going to be special no matter what because it comes from a really special place in my heart. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Lacey and Neil. Is it the autumn leaves that change? Or the snow that flows from the sky? Where's the time gone in the blink of an eye? But with every blink of her. is time. Thank you, guys. Okay, Adam, let's come to you first. Um, I, I want to start by thanking me and Michaels for bringing something so beautiful and personal and special on to the American public. <laughs> and for perpetuating true beauty and dance for so many people. Um, you are unreal. Thank you, Mia. Um, you guys, I'm so in love with what you just did. You guys were not dancers. You were acting an entire world. You were performing an entire piece. And this will be going down as one of the great dance performances on television ever. <laughs> like last week. It was, it was so special. Um, Neil, unbelievably um, beautiful. Once again, you know, to get technical, your center is beautiful. But I didn't care. I didn't care because I felt a performance. Lacey, gorgeous. Perfect. I love you. Very high praise indeed. OK, let's get to Mary. <laughs> Mary's going through a personal time at the moment as well. So, um... Forgive her. Um, OK, let's talk about, first of all, Mia Michaels. She's an Emmy-nominated choreographer this year for the Park Bench. And I said last year how honoured I was to be on a television show where she choreographed the Park Bench. Uh, and I say again this year how honoured I am to be on a show where she's choreographed this. Um, how anybody could imagine choreographing a meeting between their late father and themselves is remarkable in the first place. To actually then take away from all technique 
and just ask you to dance as though no one was watching. That is the magic of that routine. And you both did it brilliantly because you forgot about technique and you just danced with emotion. There's nothing can be said about that. That, that is up to the public now to decide whether they like it or not. Uh, I'm hugely touched by it. Um, it's one of the most beautiful things I've seen ever. personal to Mia and you knew the story there must have been a lot of pressure on you guys because you wanted to get it right I'm guessing if somebody gives you something to do like that you must just want it to be brilliant you know absolutely of course <laughs> this was the hardest thing ever but it was so beautiful and yeah. I'm very blessed I've done this so thank you Mia thank you thank you very much indeed okay <laughs> to vote for